once again warm welcome to the channel and a very very quick video this time it's about Lorby's access and those it's about stream deck and connecting them to microsoft flight simulator uh, as you know i've done a series on it and a couple of feedbacks on the videos they got problems connecting uh, if you are one of those people this video is for you very very quick very short something i so i put hands up my mistake i didn't add it on the very first introduction video but um if you are experiencing problems a couple of minutes of your time this will fix it if you're not experiencing any problems don't bother watching the video go and do something more useful like fly anyway let's quickly jump down into um the screen and there we have uh, sorry, uh, that stinger was, uh, wasn't was supposed to be there. It was supposed to be a nice animation. I'm playing around, trying to get things a little bit more professional. Anyway, I digress, as I usually do. Where you have to go into Access and O's, you need to connect it to the simulator via a web socket. So if I can zoom in just a little bit on here, you're going to have to go into Tools, and make sure you tick this box here enable the web apis arm port 9080 and that will talk to the simulator now a couple of people have done that when i've spoken to them and it still hasn't worked what you actually have to do if that is your problem click this port settings and you get this pop-up which i need to drag down onto the screen so you can see it um Port 9080 is the one we're going to use. You don't change it. Just click in there, click apply, and restart the web socket. And you're up and running. It should now work. So that was it. If you have more problems, um, hey, drop a note below, and I'll see what I can do to help. But I am hoping... He says if he does that one, I'll come back up. I'm hoping that will fix all of your problems. As usual, enjoy your flying. Stay safe, and I will catch you again soon. Thanks for watching.